All right, everybody, we got the Stillness of Wind here. I got this on sale, and I've had my eye on it for a while. I think it's more of a narrative-based game, but I'm recording in the morning for a change, and I'm, like, super blown out. Maybe if I just don't even... That's better, and then it's not in my eyes. The Stillness of Wind. Like, it looks like one of those casual games, more story-based, and, yeah, instead of recording after work, and being tired of not being able to play first-person shooters. I was like, you know what, let's have a casual morning. And let's play a game. That's a bit more chill, hopefully. If this game ends up being the most intense, action-packed FPS game of all time. And that's news to me. <laughs> Move and interact. And drop and cancel. Okay. Talma grew up on this farm. Oh. Or like me walking is point and click. It's me basket. I check the mail. Got a mailbox. Nope. I would prefer if you kept that with you. One by one, everyone left for the city or across the sea. Ah, oh, we're inside. What's going on here? Mending this churn house, the shelving, ventilation, space. Um, the last thing Sola did before she deserted the farm, leaving Rama behind. Oh, we're getting overlapping, there was other text. Hmm, these five cheeses won't last forever, with two goats a pocket full of seeds and the sunlight in her boots. Okay, I'm getting multiple streams of conversation, and now we have cheese that won't last. That's very sad. And more milk to the pot. To add more milk. Ah. But are we going to be making more cheese? If we already have cheese we need to get rid of? What's the situation? But I love the graphics. It's very chill. Very warm, inviting. It has that sort of vintage film haze kind of a feel. <laughs> One summer, with a few hairs on his chin, Garza rebuilt this goat house. The next in a long line of Yuma's reaching through time. Hello, can I pet you? Yes, I can. They can hear her chuckle. And you have a scarf. Fence is broken. Uh oh. So, we've checked out that area. Oh, we got a gun over here. We're not going to check that out just yet. Let's check out what this side of the house has to offer. We got some chickens. Hello. Cannot interact with you. Okay, we got our garden equipment. So, what else am I supposed to do? What is this? Oh, okay, we close the door. Now the goat's coming inside. Are we checking out over here? Ooh. Here I only see my father leaning a clenched fist against the pole moments before his heart surrendered. Wow. Well, that's not exactly a happy story. Well, I mean, the whole premise of being deserted on a, a lonesome farm isn't exactly a happy story. So, we're gonna actually let me go back in. Is there any milk already in here for us to use? I don't know. No. Nothing for the fire yet. Maybe I can go out the front gate? I'm thinking so. No, alright, we're stepping out. Actually, I see you. 
You thought you were getting out? Nay. Even though that's not the sound you make. But look at this, we got some desert roses. Oh, this looks like a burial site. Aluna. You just paid homage. Yep. Yep. That one's a burial site. That's not sad at all. Just bury you uh, out in the front yard. But we can pick flowers. So we're going to go and do that. <gasps> Music's kicking in. Listen to the sound of the music. All right. Oh, no, these are mushrooms, are they? Dixie House. Wanderer's Feast. Okay, that's it there. Thanks for the mushrooms. Um, oh, camera zooming out. It's gonna show us how it looks. Oh, and you can see it's starting to get dusty. Like visions, kind of. In a way, I think that's kind of the point. See the rocks up there. All alone. Oh, we got some mushrooms here. Astronomer's beard. Is that actually a, a mushroom? We got more wanderers feast. So if we continue along, I don't know what we might run into or if we'll just keep walking. What are we doing, game? Your bird. It definitely does give off that feeling of like this loneliness and isolation where you're just in this space by yourself. <clears throat> oh goodness, attack the morning voice. Yeah. Oh. Okay. It might just be walking a bit far now. Let's go north. I'm assuming this is north. And we're just gonna do it. Because however far we go, we have to come back. Which isn't exactly an exciting prospect at this point in time. But I will have to find where or how I can milk. Like, are we using goat's milk? Do we have cows? Is there another part of the house? Like, if we go the other direction? I don't know the situation. Oh, we got something. I like that the cursor's a little leaf. Ooh, we got some stone ruins. Yes, we do. After Sola left for good, I realized why she often sat here as a teenager, looking at these stone shoes. Oh, like, like this is the bottom of the foot, and like the legs are going into the ground. I see it. Wait, sorry, I didn't finish. Uh, to her, they are familiar. To her, they felt familiar. Okay. So I'm assuming Sola is the daughter? In a bigger camera angle now. Back to walking, walking on. Okay, we're gonna start heading back towards the house because I don't want to get too lost. Just kidding. We're heading this way. 
put another thing we can put in our basket. Brilliant. Multiple shrooms. Do I have, like, a limit of items I can put in? I don't know. Bungle brought. Sure. We ickle footsteps. Oh, it's getting dark. Uh-oh. I need to head back. Okay. Okay. I'm going, I swear. Taking these, and we're going to read this. Oh no, you're getting tired. Can I not read this thing from here? On every Sunday morning of his last year, Grandfather gave us, gathered us around this rock and told us tales of his faraway friends. <gasps> I'm going home, I swear! Do the winds calm down at night? It looks like that. What a visual. Pretty cool. Oh. Here's the house. Okay, so I just started walking too far in that other direction. It's dark. We've been out all day. We made our way back. We wandered and we gathered. So now I have mushrooms. Wow. It'd be pretty dark for the YouTube video, but. Do I put the mushrooms in here? Oh, I left it at the front door. You know what? That's fine. Let's go to bed. Ah. Okay, there's something off to the left. Wow. Look at that night sky. <laughs> and guess what? It's morning time. Great use of colors. So I hope there's not like a feeding mechanic I need to worry about. Oh, you know what? We got a bucket. Is this a thing where I could just, yeah, yeah, this is it. Milk and the goats. So do you just fill up a whole bucket for me? You're like, yeah, yeah, I do. Thanks, goat. For your goat milk. Not oat milk, it's goat milk. Ha ha ha. You got that? We can add it in here. Why not? Okay. Art of the way to one cheese. Okay. Oh, we're stirring it. We're busy making cheese. Whistling. I gotta move laundry over. Wow, I'm, you know, making cheese in the video game gives you time to reflect. Ah, uh, the camera just looks like I'm so blown out. I don't know what to do. Well, I know what to do. No matter if I want to do it. Oh. Well, it's stirred. But I need to set that thing on fire. 
well, you know, light it, not just like flames. Uh, we're just gonna drop that right there. So mushrooms are gone. I don't know if there's something I needed to do. Hey, lady, get out. Oh, you were being a naughty little goat, weren't you? Trying to escape. So do I technically lose those mushrooms? I don't know. When my ancestors first settled here and found this well before them, they adopted as their name an ancient word for wellspring, Yuma. Well, isn't that a nice little tidbit of family history? So, my curiosity now is what do we see off in the distance? The little glimpse I got, it looked like a mine shaft or something? I don't quite know. Do, 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 do. Going out. Oh, we can take some mushrooms over here. Very nice. Out by these rocks. I'm pick you. The little birdies. Journeyman's foil. Pixie house. Yeah, the names pop up and go so fast. Some of them I'm paying attention when it happens. Other ones I'm like, wait, hold on, what? Bungle brat. Oh yes, just picking some bungle brat. Don't mind me. Okay, I see these over here. We'll start heading in a bit of a diagonal, just in case there's something more over this way. I just want to see the rock. This is it. This is what I saw. Me, 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 me. Pretty sure you wouldn't hear birds in the desert like this, but you know, not complaining. It's nice. Mm. Well, you know, just picking up some more astronomer's beard. I forgot to click on the rock that was by the other mushrooms. Maybe on the way back, you know? Hey, what's the deal with this? In these mines that allowed the city to grow fat on a valley veined with silver, uh, Amy was once lost for two days. All right, we have another name. A person. And no longer lives around here are they all just a family because like this house is big enough for me got a bed for me you know like what's going on yes birdie 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 This is what I want to click on. You see my footsteps disappearing. It's kind of cool. Walking right on through. Somewhere there is a photograph of us all sitting on these rocks. Me with Sola and Aluna. Amy with Bren. Garza with Moira. A lot of names is going on here. What the heck? She stops walking, I'm like, uh, are you okay? But I remember that I need to click. All right, look, we made it back before sundown this time. Being more efficient with my time. Although, don't know what the situation's gonna be for getting that fire started for making cheese. And why are we making more cheese? 
if we have five wheels that aren't going to last forever. I don't know. Wow. The game looks really saturated in the OBS, and I'm so blown out right now. What the heck? Camera adjust. Seriously, maybe turning this on is going to help? Hmm? No, I just look terrible. Or maybe there's something weird going on there. I'm not going to worry about it right now, because what am I going to do? Oh, you can click on that. And I will. Well, you see, as soon as you open the gate, they're like, oh, hey, what's going on? Oh, no, no. Ring the basket. Unless I can't bring it inside. Okay. That is a curious mechanic. So I've picked these. Do I, do I feed the goats? Oh, laughing at the goats, yes. So we got a broken fence post. I gotta be on the outside for that. Okay. I don't know the point of these mushrooms. We're gonna find out what this does. A rocket ship soars between great stars, carved on this fence by a six-year-old Rama missing her mother. Aww. Those sneaky goats. <sighs> okay. What do I do with the mushrooms? Oh, I can take them inside the house. So did I lose the mushrooms that I had before? Oh, jeez, I don't know. We're throwing in the cheese. I honestly don't know what I'm doing here. Do I have to make like a certain recipe? There's probably a recipe sitting around. Well, didn't eat yesterday, <laughs> so we're eating today. Hmm. So, what's the deal? Ooh, we got a letter. Uh, Nana Talma, I finally made it. I'm in my cap and gown sitting here in the empty theater an hour too early, trying to hold myself together. But every minute that the ceremony comes closer, my chest swells with a hundred new butterflies. Everything finally feels real. Tonight, I graduate from the Academy. And soon I'll say goodbye to this planet and ship off to the colonies on Luna. Wow. You've always been there for me, Nana. Reading to me every night when I was little, even now, a volume of Wormgal and Laika stays by my bed. Taking me to winter stargazing fairs and gypsy carnivals in summer. You raised me to know the horizon hides the, you raised me to know the horizon hides the wonders of the world so i've always rushed forward people say i take after you like that you're the best nana i'm still amazed at how you keep the farm running so well on your own i have so much to learn i'll come see you again soon i promise with a million hugs rama oh can i yeah okay so still in contact Do I have to eat all the cheese to progress? That seems like a pretty solid game mechanic. <laughs> Saving. All right, we are now on to day three. So we've been out to these. Did I go to that one? I feel like I did. Foreground, so you're out there. Okay, go click on that. Okay. Walking out with me, basket. 
go. Let's uh figure out what the deal is with this gun. Oh, grandma ready. Oh, you're just saying hi because I'm clicking on you. <laughs> Don't mess. Don't mess with grandma. So, I tried clicking on broken fence, didn't I? Is there anything? Okay, we're going to go back in here. See what's up with the cheese. They see now we only have four. Can I light this? Oh, it was just, okay. Just a thing. And I assume we're good to leave it? Don't feel like the house is gonna burn down. Well, I say we venture southwest. If there's anything fortuitous beyond, we went to the little well. I haven't done anything beyond. So I don't know what lies ahead. Or like, what happens if you just keep walking? Ooh, we got mushrooms. Aha, uh -huh, we do got something else. Pick up the mushrooms. Yeah. Uh-oh. There we go. Let's not get stuck. Did I get a phone call? I did not. Yep. Okay, we're good. Wanderers feast. Amazing. So I feel like I don't need to eat that many mushrooms at night. I often think of the morning I sat here alone, one hand holding a letter from my last choice university, the other clutching this rock. Ooh, thoughts way back. So did you choose not to go to university? And stay on the farm. And is there anything out yonder? Like, would we reach a point where it's like, okay, you should uh, turn around now, go back? What? What happens? Cause like, what if I got really close to something, but I don't know, and I turned around right before I got to. Oh, okay. No, we reached too far. Well, at least the game is willing to tell us that way. Look at these double footprints. Any animal tracker is going to be so confused as to why. They're like dashes of four. And now it's messed up. It's not so succinct anymore. It's like a double footed beastie. We're making the trek back. I swear. Okay. I seriously hope I don't look this blown out in the actual footage because it's crazy. And I don't know what to do to help it. Maybe if I. But then it's not. That's the luxury of using a webcam. Okay, see, see, then that adjusts just fine. But then it tries to set up the whole. Okay. I see. I need to work on getting my uh my setup more organized. But that shall come in time. So 
So aside from oh, oh, you're new. Goodbye, Tama. What you 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 ain't leaving? What? You just this what? I haven't seen another person at all, and all of a sudden, excuse me. You just leave. Be the male person. I was legitimately just about to say, like, what else is gonna happen in this game? I don't know. But then I think we got some mail. We did. I think reaching the, the boundary is a big part. Like, okay, you're exploring. Aren't you happy for the letter? We'll read that this evening. Oh no, I left my shotgun on the ground. Foolish me. Let's bring in the mushrooms. There's mushrooms right in the back there. Well, oh, there's a big one. Okay. The mushrooms are there. Let's read this letter that we got. Um, from Amy Yuma Margot. Marigot. Whoops. Uh, Queen's Crown Suites, apartment 206, Hightown, Elgus City. Oh, okay. Dear Talma, my grandson is born. With ten fingers and ten toes, he entered the world early this morning, two weeks before due. It seems the little summer prince preferred the spring. Elazar, they named him, in a scene that could have only, that could have been painted from myth. The boy nestled in the arms of his triumphant mother, as his father and the rest of the family gathered around, a glow with the light of dawn streaming in through the window. Even now, sitting in my office, I can think only of that magnificent sight. I had to come to work directly from the hospital, as my newsroom is quite lost without me. I hope you are well, well Talma. Since the, the bridges collapse, our Laszlo and the Black Cliff Trail have been the only way our letters can reach you. The mayor, meanwhile, abandons the telephone poles to sink in the sand. Unacceptable. Hopefully we can visit the farm again soon. I know of one little boy who would love to meet his great aunt, your brother, Garza. Uh, sister dear, I've just had a lovely little adventure. On a white hot afternoon, I visited Midtown's newest market here. Among dozens of stalls, I discovered jars of sweet sap from an albino heirloom tree in the Ashlands, Ashlands, um, which they say rises only once in a century, and strips of pickled chewing leather uh, for when my pet platypus behave well <laughs> platypuses you got some good animals the best of all the grand treasure was the gold flaked white cherry toffee I chanced upon just like we had on our girls trip to the city to think how many boys followed us around then I'm getting tired if only you'd been there Ama no I won't try again to convince you to move Granny did say, abandon this farmland, it will all blow away. That woman spotted omens everywhere she looked. I only mean to say that today brought back memories, and I dearly miss my sister. Stay well, Ama. Love, Mimi. P.S. With the ladies of the Windows Bridge Club raving about a charismatic young author, I've enclosed a copy of her newest novel to you. Perfect for an afternoon read in Papa's chair. And another to Rama and Luna. After all... There's so little to do on farms. So everyone moved away and they're trying to convince me to move. But then, this is the life I know. Yeah, just as I was about to say, uh, what else is happening here? I don't know. It was like, I got you. We're making progress. So now we dive back in. So instead of going out for some crazy adventure, I was just going to say, we're going to check the cheese. Ooh, why we got a crow? Hey, birdie, 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 birdie. Yeah, that's what I thought. So, I see that sign. 
Does that mean? What does it mean? Cheese. Oh yeah, sorry we didn't eat yesterday. Whoops. Um, seeing like that block mechanic show up. Does that mean that I like have to pet the goats or something? Clean them? Give them a bath? What's the situation? Like it would show up and then disappear. Okay, so it's not there now. Oh, that's the odd symbol. Yeah, okay. Weird. I don't know what to do about it. So I think we let's go pick those mushrooms. Actually. Is there a thing for me to like scrub them down? You know, you need to move away from the door because you are going to be trying to escape. I feel like that means that they need to get a brushing or something, but I... I don't know. Don't know what to do there. Me. Yeah, I don't think this is helping. We're going around this way. Oh, there's a down thing here. Oh, that's the bit in there. Let's harvest these mushrooms and then we'll spend the afternoon reading part of that book and see if that does anything for us. What's this one? Oh, that's the bungle brat. Okay. Astronomer's beard. Yeah, I gotta have something I'm Pretty sure we have to brush the goats. Going back inside. Well, let's cook. We made some new cheese. We're gonna add some pixie house and astronomer's beard. And honestly, I don't know. Do I have to like hit some secret recipe? Nom, 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 nom. Ooh, that was a good one. You sound happy about that. Okay, can we sit down? Yeah. And then read. Do we have a book? Oh, you have to, yeah. Castellin. So, what now? I don't have inventory. Oh, seeds. means we could well you know what let's see oh 
start it off over here. Gonna plant cryptid seed. Don't you dare eat it! Um, I assume that we need to go grab some water. Out to the well we go. You can see the shadows are slightly starting to get longer, so we should have just enough time to go and do that. We can head on in and read after we water the plants. Oh, is that a... no. Well, I know where the bucket is. Please, bucket, don't get lost. Watering at night is better for your plants because then it doesn't evaporate in the sun. There you go. Excuse you. We're going inside. All right. Ah. By Fremo, by Soleda Labeth. To meet someone from Fremo is to learn that an open window is always better than a closed one. Everywhere there are ears. They listen for a word forbidden from utterance, despite the city's reputation as the half city of twins. <laughs> for to invoke this word is to tear the delicate cocoon constricting the grief of its citizens. Long ago, to war against a fatal sickness that afflicted only twins. The vagrant Maggie planted a branch of their ancestral tree in the city to peddle a cure called the Father's Gamble. The tincture brewed as one, then split and served in halves. The hand that passes the cups must live with the reality of only one surviving. Thus, what greater mercy could there be than a league of men who do not remember they are fathers? Woo! <sighs> And speaking of which, there's that phone call I was looking for. Hello? Alright, I left this lady waiting way too long. It's time to go to bed. Uh-oh. I didn't close out of the UI. With a book. And it's the next day. Can I close out of it? There we go. All is right with the world. You definitely need some sort of brushing. And the little plants are growing. So now, I'm going to see if we can fill up the bucket that I left out here. That'd be convenient. There's a mushroom. Can I fill up here? Or is this bucket only for goats? It is only for goats. Oh. We're gonna bring you home, bucket. We're definitely gonna need water. So is there still any left? Oh, there was. That's more convenient. I thought I'd have to go back and forth every day. Yo, what do we do now? Oh, we got another letter. I didn't run into the mail person.
Oh, don't have a basket. Whoops. You can't just take one with you. We got another letter. Another day, another letter. Oh. Well, we gotta go get us that mushroom. Who would we be if we left that mushroom all by itself? My good. I see you being sneaky. Yeah, I think I'll pick this, I'll drop it off inside, but then my goal today is to figure out if I need to. Oh, no, 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 no. How dare you? You keep on going your own way. You see, they immediately <laughs> go for the door. Okay, we're going inside. I'm dropping off my mushroom. And I'm going to see if there's anything I can use to actually brush you off. We drop. Almost. Here. Read. No. Basket. Oh. This is a hen house. That makes sense. Didn't realize I had to open and close the door. Whoops. So they were some busy chickens. Now I have more cooking ingredients. Cool. Not all I was trying to do, but you know, another new mechanic found out. Happy about it. Oh, mailman, mailman. Hello. Hi. Human interaction. My dear, do I have news for you? The city of Elgos has found its new mayor. Wow. And it is none other than the cousin Voda. Dan cousin Voda. Uh, that handsome frog face is on every newspaper. From our leaders, we expect honesty. I better not see any flies coming out of his mouth. <laughs> Balance of justice. Oh. Billy Goat. Well, we can trade based on what we have. Hey. That's what they want. They want food. I will take two hay. Shotgun shells. For cheese. Cool. That's what they wanted. Got the mail. I want your billy goat, though. Gray potato. <gasps> potato seed! Two. If I take two of those. Two eggs. Three eggs isn't enough. And a mushroom. So I'm trading you. Well, isn't that a fun little mechanic? I had no idea. I wouldn't think that I need the billy goat, but here we are. So I need to be able to catch him to trade. I'm waiting on groceries to be delivered. So we're going to separate a little bit. Got that one. So we're gonna do cray, gray, not cray. Then we'll go for the other one. And then let's see how many waters do I get out of this? You can go for another one. I just like put you over here again. There we go. I mean, that'd be kind of a convenient uh, mechanic if it just doesn't 
<laughs> empty. Okay. Let's see. We're gonna put in an egg. We're gonna put in fungal brat. And a cheese. We'll make more cheese tomorrow. Now egg, cheese, and mushroom all together. Okay, it wasn't overwhelming, but you know, you ate. <laughs> All right. Definitely feel more accustomed to the pace of the game now. Before I was like, what's happening? But now that I've explored and kind of figured out how things are working out, this is feeling pretty good. Oh, we're getting a really dark screen. We're not coming back. I was just about to end the episode. What's happening? Do I click? I clicked. This is a whole new... This is a whole new thing. So I hear what might be station noises. What is going on? Is this bad weather? Did I get myself food poisoning? I'm moving real slow. Oh, this must be a dream because this is the billy goat. This is a dream sequence. What even? Yeah, because you can hear the trains and stuff. Yeah, that was a dream sequence of sorts. Wow. This game knows, just as I'm about to call something, they're like, hmm, actually. And now we wake up. And there are more mushrooms about. So the game is saved, we went through the night, and I think you can see our plants are growing. Um, doing these in a little bit longer episodes is a, is a fun way to go through it, just relax, chill with it. I'm having fun, but this is a great place to leave off. We've figured out the mechanics to a good extent and things are actually starting to happen. And it is actually pretty rewarding. You get like this, this barren wasteland of this desert and you start finding things to do. And then you're just like walking around slowly alone. And then all of a sudden to see the mailman just walk up, you're like, oh, you in contact, which is actually sort of the point. I'm falling asleep here. <laughs> So I think that's definitely part of the point of the game is navigating the space on your own and being alone. So yeah, I'm enjoying it so far and looking forward to playing some more, but that is gonna be it for this episode. So thank you everybody for watching and stay tuned.